Good afternoon. A homicide investigation is now underway near Church and Shooter Street. Police say they are lo looking for suspects, two men and two women. CTV's Mike Walker is on the scene to bring us the very latest on this. Mike. Well, Nathan, Michelle, there is still a police presence at this apartment building near Church and Shooter. Police say the man was reportedly pushed from a balcony to his death. We've been speaking with residents at this building who tell us they heard commotion just before midnight. A forensic investigator can be seen collecting evidence from an eighth floor balcony where police say a man was pushed to his death. I heard a man scream. It's last two seconds. Wow. Then I heard this, this sound. Like something hit the floor. Residents at the building at Church and Shooter describe hearing commotion just before midnight. Just like a lot of like banging, stuff being thrown around. Um, I did hear like around 1130 there was like a commotion in the hallway. Police say the man was pronounced dead in hospital. This morning an officer could be seen guarding the eighth floor apartment. Doors to the stairwells covered in fingerprints. We saw in the morning like they were dusting off the fingerprints I think and we were just curious like what's happening around and we just asked like and we were like completely shocked because we didn't know like what's happening around and yeah it's scary. Neighbors say in the last two weeks they've heard commotion from the apartment. We just hear a lot of like arguments, door slamming, glass shattering like all the time. Police haven't said what events led to the man being pushed off the balcony. At this point they have not released his identity. Now again, police are looking for four suspects in this case, two men and two women. They haven't provided much more of a suspect description at this point. We are expecting more information from police later this afternoon, and we'll have those details when they become available. Reporting live, I'm Mike Walker. Michelle, back to you. Thank you, Mike.